that was our show and we deserve to reclaim it. Uh, you know, now we're kind of like, well, what might a feminist reclamation of our show look like? You even said last night at Trick that you really didn't miss him. <gasps> Don't you dare. Don't you dare twist my words around and make yourself feel like you are not a backstabbing, two-faced bitch, Peyton, because you are. And you know it. A little One Tree Hill reunion tonight. So with that being said, are we getting a reboot anytime soon? Or? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Everybody wants to know. What I will say is, I think for a long time our answer on that was a firm no. We were really ready to put it to bed. And then with the girls and I deciding that that was our show and we deserve to reclaim it. Uh, you know, now we're kind of like, well, what might a feminist reclamation of our show look like? I don't know, but the podcast has brought us some joy, and I think it has changed our answer collectively from never to never say never. Yeah, so you're the open. You're down. I don't have any answers for you, but yeah. things change over time. What would your character be these days? <laughs> um, you know, I always joke that I think... Brooke Davis running for class president really changed the trajectory of her whole life. I'd like to see her in elected office. Oh, that would be so you good. know, I'd really like to see her delivering an impassioned rant about what people deserve. I, I think that would really be right up her alley. So we'll see. What's the biggest thing that you miss about the show? Oh gosh. Um, I know you're like everything. You know, it's funny. I don't think you miss anything for a while when you wrap a job other than your friends because you did it and you're so ready to do something else. And then there is an undeniability to what was special about it. It's the reason we're all here. It's the reason so many of us showed up to work on this movie. It's the reason so many friends are here at this premiere tonight. It, it really gave us a family that feels like one in a million. I was speaking of family, final question for you, Brooke Davis. I mean, yeah. where is she at these days? What's going on? Do you have any update? Oh, you mean past, like, where, like, me thinking she'd be, in, like, an elected official? Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know. Uh, I guess, you know, it's weird to think that my character would have two kids that would be teens now. Is that right? Yeah, okay. Close yep. to teens. Okay. I don't know how old they'd be. I haven't done the math. But, like, definitely in middle school at least, which is so wild to me because all my friends are starting to have kids. I have a two-year-old godson. And, Cute. whoa, like, they're magic. And they also take so much energy. I look at Brian and Jamie with their twins, and I'm like, I don't know how y'all did it. I did it on TV, and it was hard. You're doing it forever. <laughs> Hats off to you. You know I got to ask. Yeah. One Tree Hill okay. reuniting with Sophia yeah. Bush. Yeah. And I hear a bunch of the rest of them are going to be here tonight. Yeah, I, how, so. I think we're in for a treat. Yeah. What, what was that like to see her in action and have that reunion? So I was amazing because I've known Sophia for almost 20 years. And, you know, we didn't get a chance to work together too much on that on that project. And we were, you know, but we became friends. And so, to, for, so we have, like, such a shorthand, such a history and such a connection. And she plays my ex-wife in this. And there's so much love between these two characters. And I feel like because of our history, that really comes off on screen, and uh, she absolutely killed this role. She's so good in this movie. I can't really wait for people her. to see her. I cannot wait for people to be proud, Great. too. So we're going to get a reunion, I hear? A reboot? Uh, we might. What, oh, Hill? oh, maybe. I see a couple of cast members in the, in the building. I know. I really made it. Give me the scoop. Oh. Give us the, give oh, us the exclusive. Hey, if there is, I don't know about it.